Yeah. Hello everyone. Today I will be testing the Hyperland window manager. I saw a lot of people using it in our Discord server. So I decided to give it a try. So I boot up my Endeavor OS virtual machine on the Endeavor OS system, log in as Ver, and then I launch the Hyperland, which uses Wayland protocol, which is better than Xorg, at least that's what they say. Hyperland is so good that it starts with the capital letter. As you can see it has some graphical bugs, but probably I didn't configure something, I don't know. When the light's out, it's less dangerous. Ok, so it writes, let's enable the full screen mode. Um, it writes, you're using... One second. You're using auto-generated auto config. Yes, I do. Super Q launches Kitty and Super M exit Hyperland. Ok. Uh, it has a very nice animation. Let's not bring the attention to the flickering. I am sure it is a temporary bug. What I love about tiling window managers is that the windows are stacking near each other. So I open another window and another and as you can see it stacks very nicely. You can also open up Firefox really quickly. Yeah. So I am sure you can also open it to full screen mode. Uh, no, unfortunately you can't. Oh, oh. Oh. Um, okay, let's... Just so you can see my setup, I'll install NeoFetch. Um, I can't see what I'm typing, but I'm sure I don't didn't make any errors. Okay, let's run. Let's reopen the terminal because I can see it. Are you okay? Um, new face. Yeah. So, uh, as you can see, I am using the Endeavor OS, which is based on Arch Linux with the uh, Hyperland desktop environment uh, or window manager, whatever. I use the Kitty terminal, and the virtual CPU is Intel i9. So let's open up Firefox again. What I love about Hyperland is that it has the nice rounded borders and the gradient border around them. It really gives the aesthetic feeling. So let's open up my YouTube channel. Uh, yeah, it is my channel. So, Hyperland is quite nice, but I think it needs uh, some some configuration to prevent uh, the minor graphical glitches. I tried to avoid this, but seems like it is an eternal issue. But if you like the open source software, you shouldn't really be worried about those bugs because. Bugs are temporary, but the ideas are eternal. So thanks for watching. I see you in the another video. Um, yeah, I'll post another slender uh, soon. Thank you and uh, have a nice uh, night.